right, now we're going to focus on having a Kimura, or getting a Kimura, I should say, from the knee on belly position, okay? Because there's a lot of times where guys, they decide to put their arm where they should not put it, and that gives you a submission, okay? Because the knee on belly is a very uncomfortable position. And from there, it opens, you, it opens the person up to want to relieve that pressure. When they do that in certain ways, it gives you opportunities to submit that person. So I'm here in knee on belly with my guy here. And let's say, so I'm here, right? I pass his guard, I'm here. A lot of guys, they don't like this knee on their belly, right? So what they do is they decide to put the knee, their arm on the knee here, okay? Now from here, I have a submission I can go for. All I wanna do is I wanna grab with my right arm, his arm. I wanna cup right by his tricep here, okay? And I wanna pull him to him, towards me. Now I'm gonna drop my knee behind his head. Here, okay? Now I'm gonna switch, okay? You don't wanna keep your arm, this is not gonna, you're not gonna have the Kimura if you keep your arm here, okay? You wanna switch first. Now you have the Kimura grip. Well, likely they're gonna be grabbing themselves, trying to stop you from getting the Kimura grip, okay? So I'm here, I can rip, 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 whatever. But really, one, one of the best ways to, to break, because this grip is actually very strong, what he has here, okay? Now, the mistake a lot of guys make is they focus, is all they do is they keep their both knees on the mat to try and keep control. But in reality, the control comes from this, okay? This is, you're kind of sitting on his head here, but you know, you're not gonna be able to finish this move unless your foot is up, because it gives you the power to be able to rip it, okay? Now when it comes to the rip, this grip that he has here is close to his stomach, so it's extremely tight. It's extremely difficult for me to be able to break it, okay? So to break it, instead of me just going for it, like, ah, trying to be, you know, Superman, I'm gonna do three fakes and then I'm gonna go for it. The fakes throw him off, okay? So if I'm here, I go one, two, three, and then I rip, okay? And I rip up. What you don't wanna do is you don't wanna rip it towards the, towards the submission, okay? It's gonna be difficult for you to finish it. The further it is from his stomach, the easier it is to break the grip, okay? So I'm gonna be here, I'm gonna go one, two, three, and then I'm gonna rip it up and then out. Now be careful with this move because as soon as you rip it up and you move it just a little bit, he's gonna feel the, the, the torque on his shoulder, okay? So, one more time. So I'm gonna go one, two, three, up, and then out. 